Welcome to this look at a new mod map on console on Farming Simulator 22 with me, Mr. Silly P. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Farm View Island. This is by Farmer Rabbit, 42.68 megabytes download. Now this is new to console. This got an update the other day and part of the update was console release. The name had to be changed. This was previously Farmville and to release on console because Farmville is a mobile game already out it was changed to Farm View Island so that's why it's new to console um, this has no required mods it has no custom crops it has no contracts available what I find fascinating is how you can get like periods of time where mods come out and you'll get maps that are very similar come out at the same time now that's coincidence um, I don't think giants go through and decide let's put this type of map out and then this type, you know. So the map review I did earlier on was Halig Petrus, which was a, an island map. And this one, an update, not a new map, um, Farmview Island is an island map. The map looks like this. On New Farmer, we start with this down here, which is the main farm, technically, plot three. Um, the field plots aren't too expensive. You, we got some smaller plots which you can pick up and then gradually build the farm up from there some larger plots with some forestry on and then a forestry plot on its own there and a forestry plot on its own there around the edge uh, like i say not too expensive at all the slot count is only 657 and then on farm management start from scratch that comes down to 577 so 657 to 577 difference being between the different versions is you don't start with any of the equipment and machinery and you don't start with the buildings at the main farm on farm manager or start from scratch so that's the difference so fairly low slot count already i'll read the description for this Welcome to Farmview Island. Due to severe climate changes, central and southern Europe has been flooded due to rising sea levels. What remains of the old lands are small islands dotted around central and southern Europe. Farmview Island is one of those islands that emerged in the aftermath where growing crops and raising livestock is still possible. You are tasked with establishing a new farm to fill the lack of farming products on the market after the floods. You will start with the absolute minimum regarding farming equipment and farm building. There wasn't enough time to save more before the flood hit the land. Will you take on the challenge and prosper once again? So it is one of those pioneer style maps. It is flat, flat as a pancake. So as far as placeables and things like that go. Now obviously you could then simulate maybe somewhere out on the edge. Having somewhere where equipment machinery gets delivered by boat, by ferry however you want to go about it, building supplies, that kind of thing, and you can gradually kind of build your way up if you wanted to go really immersive on it. You can't build a building unless you've had supplies bought in, or you might be doing some forestry to cut down trees for wood, and, you know, however you want to go about it, it's up to you. So, like I say, that's the map. We start here with our pickup, just there. We have a fuel point, just here. We've got livestock market, just there. We come round the corner. We've got the sale point just here. This is farmland shop. And we've got wood sale point. This is the only sale point on the map. But again, in preparation to setting up a let's play or a story or however you want to play, you could put whatever you want on here. You could build a mountain if you wanted to. You could put a quarry in. You could put in one of the um, ore mines. You could, you know, whatever you want to do. At the end of the day, when you start playing, it's your island. You can have it. You can have the, a volcanic island or whatever. Like I say, <laughs> the world is your mollusk. Uh, and then next to that, we have got the vehicle workshop and workshop trigger for repair. This is also the reset point on the map here at the main section. And you can see right out to the edges in every direction. So what we'll do, I'll grab the pickup and we'll whiz out to the, uh, the main farm. We do have an inlet that comes in. I mean, it's an inlet. It goes out, it's a spit or a bar, is that what it's called? Not as up on my geographical features, so I probably should be. Well, I like as well with the forestry, it's not too clustered, cluttered, it's not tightly packed. There's enough forestry, and if you wanted to clear some, I mean, it's not like there's not enough land to use, but if you needed to clear some more land, you could do, but forestry shouldn't be too difficult. And you've got little clumps and clusters of trees here and there. Now, water sources because this is an island and the inlet is just here 
The only place you can get water at the moment is a water tower at the main farm. Now there are plenty of water mods in the mods hub for standpipes and wells and you know, you name it. But you can't use the seawater, too much salt in it. Something that's always piqued my interest and I, uh, when you think of all the productions that have been available on the various different island maps or maps that have a port or have a sort of inlet or something like that, how we haven't had a desalination plant. No one's made one where because we can produce um, sugar but salt so you could maybe you know if you've got a crisp factory especially with potatoes and all the various different root crops now you could do something with sea salt I thought might be quite cool and we've never had we haven't had that before um, which I'm just thinking of this, this because it was quite specific you can't use the, the sea water and there is a water tower at the farm uh, oh that's something I need to talk about we'll talk about when we get to the uh, get to the farm so this bit is um, either dammed up or it was sort of set if we go back to the map you'll see we come around the top of here and we are at this point so this bit is kind of joined on now that could have been dammed but it is joined so the inlet is actually here there's a bridge here so the inlet comes in and runs up to the top here um, so when we come across so a right is where the water tower is just over there to our left we've got our sleep trigger then over here we've got our start equipment and machinery all of it in need of repair it all has damage, it's all dirty. Look, down the bottom, damage 40%. What's the actual harvester? 80%. 50 so yeah. All in need of a bit of work, a bit of a tidy up, maintenance. And then you kind of grow from there. Do you build a, an entire community? Just build up as a farm? Um, a little bit like the Mars mission, that rather than sending it back to Earth, you're sending it to other islands. You can you, know, you can set yourself up a little port area or whatever, or just take it to the sail point and have stuff shipped off the island if you want to, um, or build an entire community with houses and you know all those kind of things. Uh, what I was going to say that I didn't show, I've just remembered, if we go into our build mode, like I said, there are no required mods, but under build mode and sheds, we've got that shed there, shelter with back wall. If we go to containers, We've got the water tank, the water tower, which is the one that's just over here, that I looked towards. That looks like the Warner Brothers, you know, the Looney Tunes. <laughs> I don't know why that just suddenly popped into my head. Uh, and then we go from there to farmhouses, which is where the mobile home situation is. And then from there, I think we'll just paint. I think we have some additional paint textures. There's nothing else added in. You don't start with any animal pens. There's, um, you don't actually have a silo either, do you? No silo or anything like that. So yeah, it depends where you want to go with it. If we go to painting textures, we've got some cobbles and some concrete ones and you know, a few different textures thrown in there by the map maker. And that's it. That's Farmview Island by Farmer Rabbit make with it what you will be inventive i know some people thrive on maps like this and actually love the challenge of doing things like this back out across the bridge and we can head back up to the main store animal dealer i know a lot of people have been talking it's always when you see the water um, especially rivers and stuff like that a lot of people have said that it would be really cool in future versions of the game to be able to have I know Jim did it on Spectacle Island with the ferry like the and that kind of thing but we have boats that you can utilize I know on PC there are helicopters and all sorts of things like that but I think that'd be very cool but anyway that is the map that's Farm View Island by Farmer Rabbit I hope you found this useful and informative in some way shape or form if you have please give us a like if you don't subscribe yet please do if you want to leave a comment feel free and if you want to share this video then please be my guest whatever you should choose to do as always thanks for watching